What is going on? Wait, what? <laughs> vinyl community welcome to another video with the record spinner yes this is a new person that you are seeing on the channel this is my dad and uh in today's video we are going to be taking a trip over to sky valley records going to do some record shopping with my dad um he has been wanting to check out the store for the longest time and now that time has finally come and also i have been meaning to come here because i am picking up some iron maiden albums that i ordered online and i also have some trades i'm gonna do as well and who knows maybe i will find some stuff some really cool stuff to get with my trades and then is there anything you're looking for in particular nothing in particular see what he's got he's more of a cd kind of guy so if anything he'll probably try to snag some cds today so without further ado let's go in shall we All right, so after examining my trades, Chuck is going to give me $65 store credit, which I am surely going to use up today. And uh, let's see what I leave with.
All right, so we just left the record store and we made out rather well, but real quick, I'm not the only one that got stuff. My dad picked out some things as well and I'll let him go first. Okay, uh, Jimi Hendrix on DVD. You can see that. It's a Dick Cavett show. Live from the Dick Cavett show with interviews. He does songs, Isabella. Lost his uh, there. He read Train of Coming. Machine gun. Excellent. Piece of rock history. Right there. <laughs> All right. What else we got? Uh, new, new release. Zach Sabbath. Zach Wild. He does the whole first Black Sabbath album. This is a cool piece right here. This right here. Rush. Stick it out. Live from the Counterparts Tour, 1994. Soundboard recording. Excellent addition to my collection. When it comes to Rush CD bootlegs, he's all about it. I mean, just look at the shirt. <laughs> and CSN, greatest hits, got some stuff on there. Interest me. Very good selection. Awesome. And what else did you get aside from CDs? You got a little, uh. Oh. Smell good. <laughs> Smell good. <laughs> There you go. See, Sm smell that. Smell it. Mm. Does it smell good? <laughs> awesome. So he made out really well and I made out pretty well as well. So like I mentioned uh, earlier in the video, I said that I was picking up some Iron Maiden albums that I had ordered from Chuck online. And I had mentioned this in my, um, my last monthly vinyl haul that the later era Iron Maiden albums are going out of print within the US. So right now, like I am just scrambling to get my hands on whatever I can get my hands on. So I literally called him one day and I said, what do you have that's Maiden? He told me, I looked at my collection and I'm like, all right, I need these albums. And he held on, uh, held on to them until uh, the next time that I was in the store. So I left with, Virtual Eleven, this was the last album to include Blaze Bailey. Uh, Future Real is on here. The Klansmen, uh, which is influenced by um, the Braveheart film, which is fantastic. Um, probably, in the grand scheme of things, the worst Iron Maiden album, but I'm a completist, need to have everything. Uh, then we have Matter of Life and Death. Uh, different worlds on here, these colors don't run. Reincarnation of uh, Benjamin Br uh, Brieg. This is an album that I'm gonna probably revisit. Like I have it on CD, I may have listened to it once. So I'll come back to this. And then we have Iron Maiden's En Vivo. This is live on the uh, Final Frontier tour, which actually you and I saw in yes. New York City at Madison Square Garden. Yes. Dream Theater was the opening act. That was my first and only time seeing Mike Portnoy play with Dream Theater. And of course, Iron Maiden was absolutely sensational. So really glad to have this live album. So that's what I got from the Iron Maiden order from God, a couple weeks back. With my trades, I picked up some really cool things. Uh, this is actually a new release that just came out fairly recently. And my mother will be happy that I got my hands on this. Peter Gabriel, Secret World Live. This is a live album from the Secret World Tour. So I believe it was, which album was that tour? Was it, Ooh. um, what was it, the Us Tour? Yes. From the early 90s. Um, Come Talk to Me, Steam, Cross the River, um, Red Rain. I mean, it, this is fantastic. The Peter Gabriel reissues are fantastic. So I'm really glad I got my hands on this. And also, what record store do you go to where they supply you with an outer sleeve along with some polylined inner sleeves because the records do come in printed inners. So he hooked me up with a couple of sleeves for nothing, which is fantastic. And uh, this is an album that I actually had my eye on the last time that I was there, that I took a visit. And I figured the next time that I would go there, uh, I would pick it up for myself. Uh, this is the Foxboro Hot Tubs Stop, Drop, and Roll. Um, this is actually a kind of Green Day side project. This time around, they do um, kind of like rockabilly type of stuff, kind of like how XTC did uh, Dukes of Stratosphere and they did that psychedelic band. Uh, Green Day did that same approach as well. Uh, this came out, I believe, as part of Rocktober this year. Um, I didn't pick it up. 
um, when it had just come out. Like I had seen it in person and I kind of looked into it. Like I was aware of this because I am a Green Day fan. So I figured I would have this rather interesting piece of Green Day history in my collection. And it's also pressed on the Hype Sticker States on psychedelic green vinyl. And then I picked up one more thing. And uh, dad, this is one that you were gonna love. Oh, cool. Judas Priest, Unleashed in the East, live in Japan. One of the best 70s live albums. Uh, what is on here? We have The Ripper, uh, Green Manalishi, uh, Diamonds and Rust, Victim of Changes, Genocide Tyrant. This is absolutely sensational stuff right here. So there you guys go. That is yet another record store vlog, this time around doing some record shopping with my dad. If you enjoyed this video, please go ahead, give it a like, subscribe to the channel. And if you want to support this channel, be sure to check me out on Patreon. See you guys in the next video. And most importantly, keep the record spinning. That's right. That's right.